The first part of this event is kind of getting up and mingling around, having some appetizers. We got some scallops. We've got uh, arancinis, which are crab risotto balls that have been fried with a little um, aioli on the bottom. So whenever you want to, just kind of get up and move around and have some fun. My name is Patrick Hugerheide. I'm the chef with uh, Bridge Seafood. And tonight we're doing the community chef dinner at South. They've invited me to come and prepare a multi-course meal. And so I bring my chef team and we come in and we're gonna highlight Alaskan seafood because that's what Bridge Seafood Restaurant does. So we are here just to show off a little bit of what Alaska has to offer, even though it's winter time. Scallops that have been seared and chilled and then they have a Bloody Mary vinaigrette and a little pickled um, celery on top. Welcome, welcome to our sixth community chef dinner. Patrick Hugerhide is with us from the Bridge restaurant tonight. One of the reasons we started doing this in the back room was developing a sense of community with the chefs and culinary things that we're all doing around Anchorage so that we can all kind of share ideas, gather, and uh, you know push the culinary uh, boundaries forward here in Anchorage. It's a good opportunity for us to bring in chefs that you know I may or may not have worked with in the past to talk about food because as a chef you know you're kind of only as good as uh, as some of your best cooks and so to bring these guys in and to be able to see what they're doing and start talking about where we're getting ingredients and sourcing local ingredients and what we're doing with food and how we can make it better just to kind of drive the food culture forward in Anchorage. So you started off with a little bit of appetizers then we're gonna start off with our first course which is a smorgasbord so we've kind of taken a Norwegian concept and the smorgasbord will be on a piece of rye toast. In the middle we have the side striped shrimp with a little bit of a spicy tomato jam. For me it's kind of a, a nice experience to get to come and work with another chef and get some advice from him on some things and vice versa and just to see how his operation runs. We have a really tight-knit chef community around here. We do have a little rivalry in town um, but it's more camaraderie than anything else. You're good friends. <laughs>